exactly that spot. Look at the Very good. We're going to move on to our defensive plays now. I'm going to start off with uh, Thomas Brady throwing a pick six yesterday uh, against the Atlanta Falcons. It was quick. It was sudden. I don't think a lot of people knew exactly what the heck was going on. Um, I don't even know what happened, really, um, until it did. Marlon Davidson uh, is the one, the man who picked it off. So let's give a little watch to that, and then we'll uh, we'll start to, to break it down. I mean, it, we, we seem to take a lot of Tom Brady stuff uh, when it's interceptions, right? Because um, he doesn't do it often. And this one was one of those very rare ones. It was just very peculiar how it broke down, but a cool play nonetheless. It had Atlanta right back in the game. So, um so, yep, let's uh, take a look. Let me switch the screen, and here we go. Brock Dante used a timeout. Yeah. Oh, oh. he's picked off. Touchdown. Whoa. Incredible. With 22 seconds on the clock. I love Brady's face now. Like he just, <laughs> do you do you notice his like body language is like not like it's very different this year. Yep. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what it is. Even he doesn't seem excited ever. He just seems like a. Uh, he just seems he doesn't seem like he's having fun this year. And I understand the pay. Listen, uh, the Bucks are. I mean, they're eight and three. They're well, they're nine and three now. Excuse me. Uh, it hasn't been a easy nine and three but they're doing pretty well for themselves uh, but he just doesn't he doesn't look like he's having fun like he was last year i don't i don't i'm not sure what's different about him saving and, all that fun for january and february that's true that's that's probably true he just yeah just, just something about him he just seems so even keel um not hot not too high not too low just kind of flying in the middle but um but all right so for this situation that we got going on here all right, the uh, the Buccaneers are in eleven personnel shotgun, and uh, we have the formation is shotgun dice slot uh, strong side. All right, dice slot strong side. So, um, so what we got here is we got uh, this is our strong side right here. Okay, we are tight end. The strong side means that we have an extra man in the line. We got a tight end right here. So that's our strong side. Our running back is right here. And we got one man down here. That's the uh that is the formation that we're looking at in there. All right. Uh for the Falcons, they're in a four three zone. And it appears to look like cover two right out of the gate, but I believe it turns into cover four. That's what I've gathered from it. It's cover two immediately. These uh these these cornerbacks actually play back, and that creates a uh, that create ends up really creating it as a cover four. But the ball doesn't even get that far. Um, this is just that's how uncharacteristic of Brady this uh, this is. It doesn't get very far at all. I'm trying to actually find where the heck. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to find where the heck. What's his name? Marlon Davidson is at. I believe he's one of these linebackers. Uh, I think that might be him right there. But uh, we'll we'll try and find him together. All right. It's, it's like where's Waldo? We're gonna try and find him together. All right. So the ball is the ball is hiked. Uh, he looks right. Brady looks right. He shoots left, and yeah, he just didn't see. Like, usually, when Brady throws these checkdowns, it's a little bit more out. This is way too in, and uh, Davidson just is like literally just right there waiting for it. And this is you don't see Atlanta defenders making plays like this every day. No, no. Let's see. Yeah, that's. I'm pretty sure that's him. He was the. He he's lined up as the three tech. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's a lineman. <laughs> yep. He's a D lineman. And he made that pick. Um, I'm not sure what Brady's seen there. It just probably just trying to get the ball away. They're in the end zone. Don't want to give up a safety. They have to turn the ball over, I think. Uh, Atlanta's defense did do okay for a little while. Yeah. But, uh, but yeah, this is just not very Brady like. Uh, yeah, right to the guy, right into coverage. And uh, Davidson just has a just has a really just good awareness of it. Takes it with the one hand. Oh. He got mossed. 
who got yeah. mossed. <laughs> oh, he absolutely got mossed. Uh, <laughs> Pretty much, yes. Our D tackle right here. So he swings out. Got to use the timeout. He reads yeah. the screen. That's he, what he that's, reads so, it. Right. Yep. So he he feels the lineman letting him rush, and because the lineman doesn't sell his pass block well enough or his run block well enough, uh, it tips off the defensive tackle that it's going to be a screen. And then it also doesn't help that, you know, Fournette makes it extremely obvious that he's going out for a pass. So normally you like to try and give a little bit of Houdini on the play, just some sort of hiccup, little, like, I don't know, flare on the play that doesn't immediately just say, hey, uh, we're just taking an easy screenplay here, but that's what they do. It, it's, it happens a lot. You know, a lot of times it doesn't end up in a pick six. A lot of times the quarterback has to ground it, right? Yeah. The guy got in too early because the play didn't work. So that that's what happens here. The problem is that uh, this Davis dude is sneaky athletic. Yeah, a little under Yeah, he's eyeing it. Look, at Brady's ready to make the throw. And, yeah, I think if Fournette is out even just, I don't know, half a yard to his left, yep. I think he's got he's got this play and he can hit the seam and, and go from there. But, yeah, he played it a little too close. But um, you're right, yeah, this lineman breaks contact and he bounces off and just reads it very well. I remember that coming across the ticker watching the games, and I saw that they scored to make it within uh, what, four points or whatever at the time, right? And I was like, what did they do to score that quickly? Because <laughs> I knew they didn't have the ball. Yeah. Yeah, it was and a pretty know. significant grab watching that live. Um, yeah, Brady, I mean, Brady's not a pick, uh, a, a, an interception kind of guy. He's, not, he's, he's pretty smart and calculated with the ball. But uh, that might be one of his first ones to a lineman. I don't know how many times he's actually done that to a lineman. But uh, shout out to this Davidson guy. Uh, first I've heard of him, and probably maybe the last I've ever heard of him as well. But a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool moment. That's just, that's heads up football by him. Oh yeah, great, great, great awareness. Yep. So. But, yeah, I wanted to take a look at that one, see kind of why it happened. A D lineman uh, getting a pick six is uh, pretty cool. Shout out to the big guys. Shout out to the big guys. Love big guy touchdowns. Absolutely. 319. 319. Cut. 3-3. Yeah, spot. Look at the end. 